There are going to be 150,000 people diagnosed with blood cancer in this country this coming year alone. When all treatments are exhausted, the only viable treatment remaining is a bone marrow or hematopoietic stem cell transplantation. It's extremely difficult to find donors for a bone marrow transplant. And more than 65% of all people who need a bone marrow transplant will never find the matching donor. The procedure itself is very dangerous and usually up to 50% of all bone marrow transplants fail. Hemogenics, the company that I started, is planning to solve these major problems. My family is affected by blood cancers. I lost my father to a non-Hodgkin lymphoma and my uncle to my dysplastic syndrome combined with the bone marrow failure last year. I postulated that there are cells in adults that look like cells that existed during development that gave rise to first hematopoietic stem cells. So I call these cells adult hemogenic endothelial cells. And by today, we have a number of experiments conducted that demonstrate that adult hemogenic endothelial cells should be used as a new source for hematopoietic stem cell transplantation. These cells can be found in several organs, including liver and umbilical cord, isolated from the tiny blood vessels in these organs, then activated and transplanted into a patient. So we don't need a donor because the patient themselves is the donor. These cells never went through the circulation and they never accumulated mutations or chromosome rearrangements that cause blood cancer. In effect, we are resetting the clock of hematopoiesis back to zero and start from the clean slate. To move forward, we need to complete preclinical studies that are required by the FDA and conduct trials in patients. We can save countless lives together.